And um, <clears throat> what I was going to say was that um, I can't see any reason why this provision should not be uh, part of the bill. Um, I can't see a valid reason why somebody who was recommended um, in the um, short period prior to uh, a, a similar vacancy arising again shouldn't um, be deemed to be somebody uh, who is also suitable for appointment. And the point I was making was that uh, if you had, for instance, a, um, a short list which consisted of um, uh, one female and two males, and the Commission then, uh, and, and the government appointed the female to, to, a vac to a vacancy. And then, within a short period of time, the Commission has to consider another vacancy of the same type. And it decides that uh, because of its mandate to uh, try to seek gender balance, it will uh, nominate two females and one male. One male might be just dropped from the point of view of achieving over a number of uh, shortlists gender balance on the part of the Commission and just fall off the uh, edge of the, of, the, of the shelf, so to speak, and uh, not be uh, further recommended. And that, to me, seems contrary to the spirit of the legislation, which is that if one person is uh, within um, a, a reasonably short period, such as three, three years, which I think the Minister agreed would be a reasonable period, if, if, if such a person um, was considered suitable, um, why should not the government decide, well, on the last occasion it was a narrow enough um, uh, decision as between two candidates. We notice that one of them has gone, and we would like to uh, um, remedy that by appointing the person who um, we were um, most favourably disposed to after the successful applicant on the last occasion. So um, from that point of view, uh, um, I can see no harm arising from this amendment, and I'd invite the Minister to point out any harm which ar would arise from it. Um, uh, um, I can't see any myself, and um, given that uh, we have uh, altered the idea um, to, to allow persons who are no longer interested um, uh, to uh, indicate that uh, to, the, to the government so as to um, uh, effectively put themselves out of the reach of, of this particular section. Um, it seems to me that uh, there can be no possible harm and there can be a, go a good deal of practical benefit from, uh, from allowing um, uh, an amendment of this kind to be made to the legislation.